Mayor Lightfoot, thank you so much for joining us today. We are beyond honored to have you on our show. It's my pleasure. We wanted to invite you to be the Grand Marshal of our very own Pride Special. What an honor. Happy Pride! Well, I'm happy to be here with you, and Pride obviously means a lot to uh, me and my family. And do you and your family have any Pride traditions that you usually do? There's a brunch that uh, we go to, um, and then we just have fun marching in the parade. How significant is it for you to be Chicago's first openly gay mayor during Pride Month? It's such a great honor. The fact that people are embracing of who I am, of the diversity that I represent, I think really um, is a testament to what a great city we are. And moving into what our show as a whole is about, how have you been supporting Chicago restaurants during these unprecedented times? Well, if you could see my whole physique, you would know how I've been supporting them. Because I've been eating a lot. I have definitely gained the, the co hopefully not the whole 19, but uh, look, um, our restaurant community is an incredibly important part of the cultural life of our city. That's why I've been fighting so hard uh, to get them reopened. And our neighborhood restaurants, they um, are owned by people who live in the neighborhoods, who hire from the neighborhoods, and they're critically important. And I know this has been a very difficult time for them. So I'm just urging everyone, your favorite joint, whatever it is, whatever the food, go there, support them, tell them you've missed them, and eat there regularly because they are so important to our neighborhoods. Do you have a particular favorite restaurant in Chicago that you go to that your family loves? We really like uh, Mexican food. So um, there's a little taqueria called Moran's. I call, they know it's me. When I go and pick it up, the order's ready. I love those books, a family owned restaurant. Uh, we also love a place called uh, Cafe Con Leche, um, also in the neighborhood on Milwaukee Avenue. The owner owns a bunch of restaurants. Across the street is a great Italian place uh, called Saba. And then of course, because I live in Logan Square, I gotta give a shout out to Lula's um, and to Long Man and Eagle. They're all great places. Many of those places are Chicago's best alums. As I said, I like to eat. Is there a favorite meal that, that, you, that you gravitate towards when you need some comfort? If I'm going out um, for a really authentic uh, Mexican, I like, I love enchilada suizas. In Italian, I'm a big meatball fan. So I love uh, um, veal meatballs with a little bit of cheese and breadcrumbs and you know, throw in a little bit of spinach. That's good eating. And since we're talking food, I want to move into the lightning round, or what we're today going to call the light foot round. <laughs> Does ketchup belong on a hot dog? Oh no, no, no. That's a that's a total violation. I got to throw the flag on that one. Is it a sandwich or is it its own creation? Oh, it's own, its own creation. It's not a sandwich. No wonder you're so popular. Uh, deep dish or thin crust? You know, I like a little of both. I'm thinking right now, as soon as you said it, with a, a Lumanati's with sausage, a little mushroom. That's the ticket. And how do you order an Italian beef? Oh, hot dip with extra cheese. Malort, yay oh. or nay? No, 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 sorry. There's a lot of things I'll do. I will not cross that line. We've all seen the Lightfoot memes, and I, I've got to ask you, do you have a particular favorite? I like um, the one where I'm in the refrigerator and somebody opens it up, and I say, you just ate. That's pretty <laughs> funny. I guess my favorite though is, there's one that is like the old Batman distress signal and the light is shining up and it's my face. I like to think of myself as the guardian of the city. We know that you have plenty of things to do today. So I want to bring it back to the reason why we're here today. Can you tell us what does pride mean to you? Well, really what it means for me is being in a place in your own mind, um, in your own journey, that you feel comfortable in your own skin. And that manifests itself in different ways for different people. But it's just being happy and loved and loving who you are and how you want to move through the world in a way that respects um, who you are. We can't thank you enough for coming on Chicago's Best and happy Pride. Oh, happy Pride to you and, uh, and happy eating. <laughs>